let's look a look at our quest contracts first swamp thing the woodland beast is really low so I'll probably do that one first it's gray so it probably won't give you any experience which sucks but all right so woodland beast it is let's do that one because especially contracts I really like doing the contracts like I mentioned before uh, so I don't want to I really don't want to skip those at all I don't want to skip any quests I want to do them all Every single quest in the game. 100%ing this game. No, that's not going to happen. I actually wouldn't mind because it seems like the game's. I mean, well, it not seems like the game's fantastic, but holy shit. Like, that's the problem these days, right? Like, we have the greatest problem in the world in that as gamers, there's so many good games to play. There's, like, there's just too much. Like, I don't have time for that shit. Like, uh, like there's just too many mustard den. It's still white, so I haven't cleared it out. I don't think. Let's check it out. And again, if there's a darkness issue, let me know. Uh, I think you guys should see this fine. No oh, shit. More neckers, man. This place has serious necker problems. There we go. Like serious necker problems. Forward, please. Forward! What are you doing? Get off! Holy shit. I'm like hitting forward. I don't know if he was stuck. I think the horse was like stuck in the tree or some shit. Use my potion. I knew he was gonna disappear so I wasn't relying on your and staying but it does like it five seconds doesn't seem like long but it definitely matters are these enemies I mean I understand these enemies like burrow but they don't like pop out there's not like a graphic of them like exploding out of the ground they just kind of appear out of ground so I don't know if that's a bug or if there's just like no animation for them like you think the dirt would fly up as they explode out but that doesn't actually seem to happen. Anyway, what I was going to say, before I rudely interrupted myself, was that, uh, yeah, like, as gamers, we're the best problem these days. There's just too many good games to play. Like, when I was a kid, back in the NES days, like, uh, and I don't know why this is my go-to, but DuckTales, I used to play the hell out of that game. If you play that game, seriously, it's a super easy game. You can beat it in an hour or less. Uh, Sidarian Cavalry Armor? Nice. Oh, this is like a whole cave we have to clear out, it looks like, maybe. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, like, I would play the hell out of the game. And the thing is, like, there wasn't, it's not like there's a lot to it. Like, you can beat that game in less than an hour. But I played the shit out of it because, like, one, money was a problem. But that was actually probably one of the main things, right, was money. Like, you couldn't afford it. And at the time, like, renting games wasn't a big deal. Oh, superior ursine armor. Earth sign stuff, huh? Let's take a look at that real quick. I'm curious. Um, usually I try, I try to just check that stuff in town. Superior Earth sign. Wow, level 30. Never mind. I, I won't be wearing this for a long time. I'm going to guess all of it's probably high level. Yeah, 30. All right, well, never mind. It, it, that just blows my mind, the idea of even having... Oops, wrong thing. Nope, sorry. Relax. Come on, torch out. There we go. But it just blows my mind. The wait, what was I even saying? Oh, uh, just like getting that high level in this game because it's taken so long to level, even up to the point we're at now. What the? I hate when the sword like goes through their bodies. Jesus. I really should have, like, rest now. That time he obviously dodged. Alright. This ain't working. There's just too damn many. They just too damn many. Let's eat a little bit of food and water. 
Oh, for God's sakes. You can do it in combat. Why can't you just do it from the damn inventory? Makes no sense. Yeah, I definitely want the intensity to increase because the slowdown's nice, but it's not, like, really high. Making sure his buddies aren't coming out. But, like, yeah, it's, I would play, you know, me and my friends would play stuff like DuckTales. Again, an hour long game. We would, like, find ways, like, try to beat it different ways because we didn't have much else. Like I said, renting wasn't that big. Um, and there just wasn't that many games to play, right? And even back, you know, look at the SNES game days and, and whatnot. There was, you know, obviously great games, but there wasn't, like, now where where there's just new games coming out all the time. We've got the AAA thing going on. You've got the indie thing going on. Tons of multiplayer games. Tons of free-to-play stuff. And, you know, if you really want to, the mobile stuff. But... I don't know why I did that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna rest, get my potions back. But God, it's like it's such an awesome time. That's that's why I say it's like the best worst problem to have because we now have too many games to play. Like especially now, obviously as a, the full fledged adult. You know, I've got you know a job and what have you. I mean, but seriously, even if I didn't have a job, I wouldn't have enough time to play everything that I want to play. To the extent that I wanted to. Thinking of back in the day of the game like this coming out, my god. I could, like, even back in my college days where I didn't have very much money, uh, but a pretty darn good amount of time. Like, I could have easily put, you know, 200 hours into something like this. Because there's so much to do, and we don't have a lot of money to buy it. So you buy this, you know, $60 game as like an extravagance, if you will. Again, college days. But you get so much time out of it. Ooh, enhanced devil's puffball. I forget what the puffball even does. Do I have the regular puffball? God damn it. CD Projekt Red. You guys are buttholes. Uh, enhanced relic oil. Ooh, and a decoction too. Damn, this has been a pretty interesting trip so far. All right, let's check some of our alchemy. If I can remember which letter it is. Oh, God. Really? Please. White Raffords. Oh, this is what I needed the Necker stuff for. Yeah, we'll definitely make this. It looks like we can't make some of that other stuff. I'll check into the stuff we can't make later. That's not really super interesting to watch me digging through the inventory lists. Of course, I say that, yet I still play... Gwent on camera. Though, you know, again, one, people haven't really complained about it, and two, it's at least partially interesting, right? Because you gotta, you know, watching how I'm doing it. Anyway. Is this all this area? Am I, am I finished? Wow. I'm surprised they're actually smart enough to, like, have that going on, right? Like, the pot and whatnot. So are we done with this? It's still, like, white, though. Maybe it won't pop until we leave, but yeah, that's pretty much everything that's in here. Oops, I don't know why I thought opening that map again would be useful. Oh, wait. No. <laughs> still nothing. Alright. I see some stuff outside making noise. I guess that's it. Maybe something will happen when we leave? There wasn't anything to blow up, right? No? I mean, they were living in here. They weren't really underground living in here. <laughs> eh, just trying to knock it over. I was desperate. Alright, let's just leave. Let's just leave. If there's something I miss, I'll come back. I will come back if need be. There's also a trapped person up here. I don't know if I skipped it because it was too high level, or... What? Alright, got all that stuff. That treasure chest, you know, they leave outside. Neckers are big fans of treasure, I guess. 
But yeah, it's a uh, it's a pretty goddamn amazing time to be a gamer right now. And that's not even a time. That's just talking about newer stuff. Like if you want to, you can still like get an emulator and play older games. There's so many game ways now these days to play even older games that you might have. Oh, for God's sakes! I fucking hate horses so much. Like with every part of my fucking body, I hate horses. I'm still just dumbstruck whenever a game advertises you have mounted combat. I'm like, ah, that's like torture. There is. One with bigger lads, bigger! <laughs> He's like in vigor and a few other things. Oops, damn it. I hate hard. For Tamaria, you're deserters. Oh wait, I guess maybe they were I don't know. Anyway. Anyway, da 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 da. Easy horse. If you're just gonna hang out there. Damn, son. I don't see any archers. It is. See, this is stuff I don't like, is where the AI really needs some work. I would like to see them work on that a lot. Because he's just standing there. Like, why would he do that? Technically, no. Ooh, got him on that swing, that back swing. Damn! Home run, bitch. I at least wanted in a swing. Oh shit, hello. Where are you guys coming from? I love these guys just because I like knocking them off the damn horses. <laughs> He's like, God, this horse is so hard to control. I'm like, I know, right? Fucking horses, move! Hey, buddy. How you doing? Are you fucking kidding me? The goddamn horse kicked me. Ugh, ridiculous. <laughs> fucking horse. Traitor. All because he was stuck in that tree. That place has some serious AI issues. Both the horse and uh, the horses and the guys just getting stuck in the trees and standing there like dumbasses. <laughs> Fucking turned on by a goddamn horse. See, Roach is why I hate you, motherfuckers. You're untrustworthy. Wrong way. Go, go, go. Get some vitality back. So I get screwed over again. This is why I hate animals. Roach. Where was this at? There it is. I like them apples. Oh, I must have killed the archer guy before. God, oh, fucking forget it. Just forget it. Huh. <laughs> of course I end up doing it way over here. How did that go through them? Fuck your horse, bitch. He's on fire! Get the fuck away from me, horse! I know your game now, you little bitch. Son of a bitch. Stop swinging, fucking bitch. Oh, come on. Bigger, 
The guy over there like staring at the horse, now he's completely lost. He's like thought they've already won. Come on, get in the little circle, it's fine. Yeah, the archer over there is just completely even forgot what the fuck's going on. Oh damn! You were just like hit on the side. It was you weren't even like the main course there. Fuck off. Hey Archer, remember I'm here? He's like, well, it seems like I forgot something. Oh wait, shit. It takes so long to shoot. Come on. Bullshit. Bitch. What's up, merchant? Guess I gotta find the key. You can at least go ahead and preemptively thank me if you'd like. Here it is. Take these swords. Ooh, nice. More dwarven spirit. I will never say no to. Oh, come on. Hit, hit, hit. I just. I want to open a cage. There we go. Oh my god. Look for me stole by the bridge across the pond tower. Got goods for the army mostly. But I'll make an exception for you. Look for me stole by the bridge ah, across okay. the pond tower. Got goods Excuse for me? the army most. Unsent letter. My dear Helk, remember when you said, Eisber, don't you go robbing folks. The gods don't like it. And besides, only refugees on the roads these days, and they're even poorer than us. How you were cross that I shirked working in the fields and didn't bring a scrap home to put in the pot? Well, you're going to have to eat those words, my dear. Gobble them up with a hearty slice of humble pie with some baked crow on the side. Yesterday, we cornered this merchant, and not a Gore's villain or Brenna man, but... From Nilfgaard itself, you see? From the city of Golden Towers. Didn't speak much common, but enough so we could understand each other. He said he was carrying some goods to the Black Ones camp. We took everything he had, and I'm telling you, Helk, dearest, dearest, darest, you've never seen so many crowns in your life, nor could you ever hope to count that high. Now we're going to rough him up a bit more to make sure he ain't hid some of his gold or goods. Once we cut off his thumbs, he'll spill the beans about any extra treats stashed in the soles of his boots. And once Mirko scalds him a bit, he'll tell us about the precious stones he's got sewn in the feed bag. Might tell us a great many such things of interest. In fact, you never know just what till you try. Tell the young'uns dad's gonna be home soon. Then he'll bring them toys and treats, and they'll eat so many honey cakes, their tummies are gonna burst. For you, Helk, I'll bring a silver necklace and a brooch. Because while you can be awfully cruel at times, I still love you, you naughty bents. P.S. Throw on that nightshirt with the lace and red beans from bet red beans? Red beads for my arrival, and color up your kisser somewhat. Dad's not gonna come home tonight, kids. But he was a bad man, so he deserved to die. Oh, we still got some bandits over here just chilling out. Girl, you want to take your sword out today? There you go. <laughs> I'm hung on this damn tree. That's not what I meant, but it worked. Nope. Actually, you know what? I am going to axe his ass. <laughs> that works. That's even more amusing. Because stun at, like, doing the mind stun makes the horse kick him off. Why? Who knows? Alright. So yeah, this one's still white. I don't like that. Oh, and there's a quest up here. We'll go ahead and grab that. I'll probably go ahead and start just grabbing quests. See, now, that roach is like, hey, wait a minute. Does it still say, I think it still says mount. It doesn't say roach. All right, roach, I won't. Nah, never mind, you're not roach. Now you are. Now you're roach. Move it. At least in my heart of hearts, you are. And in my heart of hearts, I've always known that you really were roach. 
It's the guard. I almost attacked him just by default.